What is up everybody? We are back again with some more Stellar Blade. We are here in the Great Desert still. We're gonna go ahead and wrap things up here, hopefully. Uh, before we start, I'm gonna go ahead and change my appearance. Find one that I haven't worn yet. Have I worn this? Yeah. I worn this one, the prototype planet diving suit. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Let's see, what are we doing here? So, we've explored this area. I don't think we've been over here to this area, to be honest. So you could either go this way or that way. Um, because I haven't explored this area over here. Yeah, actually, I don't even think there's anything over there really. There might be though. Go ahead and head straight down this way, and then we'll just make our way straight down. So yeah. So yeah, I mean, as you can see. What was it like before the colony extinction? It was a dense forest. From above, it practically looked like a sea of trees. But the wars were The Zion number four. The Zion. The Sentinels release a list of anti-colony organizations, including the Zion Freedom Liberation Alliance. By decree, anti-colony organi organizations, propaganda, <coughs> propaganda, excuse me, and incitement of revolutions may be punished with banishment. Sentinels have published a list of anti-colony organizations and the criminal activities they have committed. They are known to have caused civil disruption in various ways, ranging from small acts such as circulating and spreading rumors to large-scale acts such as plotting terrorism and assassinations. The biggest shock is learning that the Zion Freedom Liberation Alliance attempted to assassinate Prophet Oracle while he was ins inspecting the plaza and exile's passage. The criminals are being chased down, but the tensions are rising as authorities have are having difficulties locating the criminals. It must be noted that the anti-colony violence causes civil unrest and destroys and destroys citizens' unity, damaging the great community spirit of Zion. We look forward to the Sentinel's swift response and urge citizens not to fall for the anti-colony organization's propaganda and incitement. Interesting. Interesting stuff there. The, the Oracle has actually been an attempt to assassinate him. I don't think we knew that. Yes, like I said, we haven't been here. So it looks like there is a campfire here. Supply camp. I doubt we have any skill points right now. Yep. Can't really do much either. This is good to find this. Now, I kind of want to see where does this go, because this goes back to Zion. But to get here, didn't we have to fly? I want to see, like, how do we get back? Interesting. Angel, did you stop? It's a very strange place. 
So, oh, okay. You remember being here. And before, I guess we just couldn't actually come down this way. Now we can. But let's go back, obviously.
this person? Wandering around the Great Desert is asking for trouble. A lot of it. There's a reason Zion makes a point of banishing its criminals. Still, something is strange about this. Who or what could have done this? Probably a Nativa. Or maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Guess it doesn't really matter either way. That's true, but in any case, it says the data chips were flowing away using drones. I'll search the area. Also, I just realized my mic was muted right there when I was reading that, so I apologize for that. Shoot down the drones and get information. So, I mean, essentially something fishy is going on, right, with Oracle. Keep, oh, wait. Truths of the Cradle. We, the Freedom Liberation Alliance, have acquired de decisive evidence about the Royal Guard's atrocity. They are using every possible means to imprison people in the Cradle and brand those who resist as traitors and purge them. They hide behind the excuses that we are running out of energy, imprison those who resist or complain in coffins, and eventually will take, will take over Zion. Should this truth be revealed, Oracle and Royal Guard's tyranny will end before the strength of United Citizens. I expected as much. Hmm. The truth under the city of Zion. No one can hide no one can hide the truth forever. Though my comrades who were after the truth suffered mysterious death, we won't stop. The Royal Guards are transporting Nativa blood through the Great Desert. They claim it's strictly for research purposes. We have obtained multiple pieces of evidence that are that there are living Nativas under the city of Zion. The Cradle, Blood, Nativas. What is the truth behind all this? The guards are haunt hunting us down. They call us traitors and they mean to track us down to the end of the world. Until the truth is out, we will protect the evidence we collected with our lives. A united people cannot be, cannot be defeated. These people risked their lives for this. I'm not sure what they were thinking. Well, whatever they were thinking. Not everything is black and white. It's all open to interpretation. Well, there's nothing more to investigate. Hey, if we're heading back, why don't we visit that restaurant again? It's possible we could have missed something. The restaurant? Not right now. Something that I do have an issue with with the game, I will say is... Like, if you are, like we're doing, kind of like, actively reading through the lore and reading these notes, it's very obvious that something fishy is going on with Oracle and, and Mother Sphere, everything, right? But for some reason, you as the player are like, yeah, like you, you literally pick it up right away that something is not right and that... They're probably lying and the good people in power are actually bad people. They're lying. But for some reason the characters the characters just refuse. Half buried under the sand. I gotta hand it to him. How did a cultist even find this in the first place? This voice brought him all the way here. Whose voice could it have been? This is another mission. But yeah, the, the characters are just kind of like... Are just... They refuse to believe what they're reading. When it's like literally so obvious what's going on. Sorry, I just wanted to see what this one is. Let there be light again. Following the voice of the truth, Felix set off to find the angel's egg. Oh yeah. Let's see what this is. I saw it. I saw the beautiful appearance of the blink i was right to come here the boat that fell from orbit the cursed ark the angel's egg they attained enlightenment after castling it all aside my eyes were wide open by their by their grace 
They are walking. They are walking in the midst of the sandstorm. They are headed to the Abyss Lavor. What secret was hidden by the... I don't know. Over there. The voice of truth shall bring the light. The voice of truth shall bring to light all ab abomin abominable secrets. I will follow. I will follow the blank, the noble one cloaked in black shadow. Whoever it was, they must have been pretty easy on the eyes. It says he went to Abyss the Floor. I'll track him down. Alright, back over here. But let's go here now. Encounter. Alright, and we do have a campsite over here. Dave, the signal I'm picking up is clear as a bell. Do you think the native Akaya mentioned could be lurking in these parts? What a tedious monster. I don't think I have anything that is worth one skill point anymore. It's dark. I can't see anything. Mary, why are you crying? I'll always be by your side. But Mary, please, don't cry. This looks like a boss area. Yep. Is that bigger than the other ones? Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> Just go off on him. It's not really doing any damage, is it? face it. Go ahead and heal. We never use these things. Oh shit. Oh damn, he got me good. 
Oh my god. Dude, this thing is going off on me now. Oh my god. There we go. Oh man, that got tough towards the end. Adam, is there anything else dangerous around here? From what I'm seeing, just some leftovers. This must be the scary monster Kaya was talking about. All right then, let's just get what we came for and get out of here. <sighs> All right. This person looks like a scavenger to me. Can you ID them? I'll try. Adam, the memory stick is intact. ID confirmed. <sighs> Judging by your reaction, it must be Kara. How sad. Well, you must have known there was no way she could have survived. That's just how the world works. Simple as that. I swear, every single mission, and maybe not every single one, like 90% of the missions are like, go find this person because they went missing. End up with finding the person dead. There's like no hope in this world, it seems like. Alright. Here next, an offer you can't refuse. Roxanne has proposed a very dangerous trade. Go find the guard turret that has gone out of control in the Great Desert. And then Roxanne, Roxanne being the information. Oh shit! I think it already. Yep, it already saw me. Damn, dude! I'm telling you, those things have 95% accuracy rate. Jesus. Damn, I couldn't get it. Cover, get the cover. I wonder if there's anything over here. Oh, there is. Come on, get to him. Harry didn't betray us. He was just desperate after being pushed to the edge. Must be suffering, thinking about what he's done. He's come back. Please forgive him. Please, I'm begging you. Probably it here. I wonder if there's a way to get on that boat. Is that the guard turret gone wild? 
facing this turret head on is just asking for trouble. We can use the trash to get into its blind spot. Blew up. Eva, do you think it dropped from this turret? Data confirmed. I think so. Something feels fishy. But I'll give this to Roxanne and get this over with. Too late. We can't go back. It's all my fault. I messed everything up. No, no. I don't want to die. Better be good. I am cool with this design pattern. Daily Sailor. I think... Ah, that's so whack.
four skill points now. We maxed out all of Taki's ability. In a suit. Black Wave. Which is essentially just like a swimsuit. <laughs> Got a, a pirate logo on the back. Oh, we can actually do another one. Oh, a drone upgrade. Nice. Rest up. we're here i'm just kind of like exploring this area or moving on to the next one find a way to get up there. Maybe... Yeah, gonna be through up here. Arctech Pioneer. Pioneers developing the green land. Arctech constantly strives for better lives. We, we the proud employees of, of Arctech, seek to break free from the evil influence of Oracle and to develop the green land outside of Zion and build an ark to provide a secure and rich life for our clients. Beyond the Natibas of the Great Desert, beyond the desolate mires and salt desert, lies the green land, the land of paradise. It is where we originate from. We were born from there and we are simply returning to where we belong. Invest in ark tech and become a valued customer of the ark. We plan to inform our investors of the location of this green land the only ark tech knows. This is a first come, first served opportunity. So hurry, we appreciate your patronage. That's actually kind of interesting. I wonder if we'll go there at some point. The Ark? Oh shit. Okay. I missed it. That was pretty fast. I see on the other side of this. Oh, what the? Have I not activated this?
So it seems like it's like what and either on top of this or like in the middle of this Oh, there's a person Who is thou? I felt it. I felt it, I felt it, I felt it. I saw the true god. I saw Blank is kneel kneeling and is transforming into the true appearance of an angel. They saw me, they saw me, they saw me. They saw me. The true go, the true good, they said. There's, there's hell. I'll be another light. The blank is their disciple. Francis, it's over for me. I miss you. This person. It's hard to imagine someone in their right mind saying that. It's all mumbo jumbo. But I gotta admit, I respect that determination. Wait. There's something here. One of those things. Memory things. Damage legacy. Yeah, that's what it is. Enable to read data. Okay, so there is a traitor. Our mission is impossible. Our hands are bloody. Calling the extinction was not the result, but the cause. Final war was twisted from its beginning. I will continue my recording as soon as I find more valid information. All for the sake of humankind. That's an angel's legacy. Doesn't your airborne squad use this recording device? You're right. Let me check. This is no good. The data's corrupted. Yeah, and here I thought we'd found something useful. Well, I guess this is it. Let's get going. We still need to report back to Francis. Okay. May your memories live on forever. And that is it. In terms of I think my exploration of actually I said I wanted to go to that thing over there I take it back and look at that we find something on here so many cans were here in the great desert No, come on, get up there. Doesn't want to let me. All right, let's go back go to back Zion. To Or actually, hold up. I think there's actually one mission where I that I have somewhere else still. Right here. So let's go to Ido Seven real quick. Oh, yeah, we're right here. Perfect. So the flooded area is right down below here. Wait, what the heck? Meeting an angel in a place like this. Lucky me. Actually, I was just about to head back to Zion. Did you find anything useful? Oh, I didn't come out all this way just to pick up junk. Then why? 
I deciphered a code that was intentionally hidden inside 807's map data. I decoded it, and this is what it gave me. Wanderers will find their rest when the song of the siren reaches their ears. The siren they're referring to probably refers to the statue of a mermaid in Patelos Plaza. Long ago, there was a time where scavengers were actually called wanderers. It was like a code that was waiting just for me. So that's why I came here, to find rest, in spite of all the dangers. Did you ever find it? No, I gave up, because finding the siren was too hard with all the nativas around. Do you want me to take a look instead? I'd be so grateful. You should be able to find rest by activating the siren with this modified fusion cell. Leave it to me. You should return to Zion. Okay. Then I'll be waiting for you there. Hey, okay. got permission here. This is like a mermaid. Oh, what the heck? Another person? What are you doing here? You're not a scavenger. I came here to look for my partners because I heard the water had dried. I'm not seeing my partners. They should be here. Partners? A while back, I was part of a trio with a couple other scavengers. We all used to scavenge around 8 or 7 back in the day. One day, mixed in with some random junk we came across, we found a clue about possible treasures in the flooded square. We got our hands on some dive suits and swam our way there. The place was brimming with treasure not seen above ground. I remember how beautiful it was. But then, bad luck met good luck. Just like that. The others started having trouble with their dive suits. I... Only I was able to escape. And your partners? They died? Yes. When I returned to Zion, I put the scavenger life behind me. And became something of a recluse. Every night I was plagued by horrible dreams. Angel, please. I'd ask that you come to me immediately if you find any evidence of scavengers here. All right. I'll, I'll be dead, you know if I find for something. sure. Alright, now we got two new missions here. There's Oh yeah, I do remember coming in here earlier. Good shake too. Best wine you can find. Let's take one of each. The three bottles Barry asked for should suffice. It isn't just Barry who could use a drink. Now let's track down the other missions here. Find his comrades. They are in there. Oh, I just don't know how to get in there, huh? But I do remember this area and I was thinking to myself, how do I get in here? Oh, what? Now I can get in here? It's the corpse of a scavenger. Actually, wait. There are two of them. Seems like they were stuck here a long time. Yes. They swam here and then found themselves stranded. Ave, I found a journal. Survival journal. This place is filled with treasure. But I didn't expect my insulted diving suit to break down. Should have done more tests before coming. But it looks like the it looks like Baron escaped. I'm glad that crybaby was able to get out at least. If he was here with me, he would have kept crying and shouting that he was scared. Haha. <laughs> Still doing okay. Got enough body cells left and preserved food for supplements. Now I just have to wait for Baron. He'll definitely come back and save us. He's a bit clumsy, but he cares a lot about his comrades. Hitting my limit, 
Why hasn't he come back? Our preparation's taken that long? Energy has fallen below 30%. Damn it. I knew Barry would do this. That wimp left us behind. Everything we own now belongs to him. I bet he's laughing. Damn traitor. Baron, you traitor. No, you damn murderer. I'll never forgive you. I'll curse your name forever. Forever. Damn. As Baron said, he and his partners dove to find treasure underwater. It looks like their dive suits malfunctioned, so they waited here to be rescued. But Baron left, thinking they were already dead. Should we keep this a secret? I'm not sure. Do you think he'll be able to take it? Let's take what we can for now and go. Well, I guess, yeah, we'll go deliver this to Baron real quick. Wonder if we're going to tell him the truth or not. We found the remains of your former partners. Go ahead and give them both. They were... They were alive. I did it. I killed them. Me. Yep. Baron, calm down. Listen, this is not your fault. Eve, I think it's best we let him be. <laughs> hey, the truth hurts. We had to tell him the truth, though. So. Now it's his turn to cope with it. They were waiting for me. <laughs> yep. Truth hurts. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, I always wondered what that was for. The building. It's all lit up. That building there is a motel. That's a place to sleep and recover, right? Yeah, that's probably why Olivia called it a resting place. The decor is somehow worse than I thought, even for cheap accommodations. But having somewhere to lay your head, that can give you the strength to stand on your feet. I agree. Still, I was expecting a little more. How disappointing. Wait, so that's it? Nothing we can do in here? Guess not. Damn. And before we go back to Zion, still, there's one more thing that we can actually do. We've collected for this one the CNL communicate and link. Collected all the network access code. Give it to Digger, which was that one machine thing that has like consciousness or whatever. Don't let your guard down yet. This is in... Oh, which one is it? Wastelands or...? I think it's Wasteland. What the heck? Oh, close. Huh. We've never been here before. It makes me wonder, can we get to it? Oh man, it's so far though. Huh. Like this little sliver right there, I wonder if we can like jump down onto it. 
might try it out. Not right now, though. Here we are. Eve, I have a question. Yes? What is it? Do you remember the process in which your ego... Um... Sending and receiving data as I spent tens and then hundreds and then thousands of seconds in the learning program. Is that right? For me, it took 27,404,091 consecutive seconds of learning. That's quite disappointing. From what I've researched so far, there are no significant differences in the process of ego formation between not even in people as specialists. I've never had a conversation. I can't help but think. All right, here we go. Perfect. Eve, I'll finish configuring the device now. Now, I just need your help with one last thing. What now? It's a simple task. I need you to enter the network code and activate the communication node. And I will be entering standby mode for the network connection. Alright. If you insist. If anything goes wrong, it's not my fault. Understand? Your concern is appreciated. But I don't anticipate any serious problems. Oh, damn. One of these. I think I messed up here. Oh, I know I didn't. device was destroyed. So, how'd it go? I am still myself. I was unable to revert to IoT mode. However, nothing has changed. My hypothesis. Unfortunately, I am even more confused about what happened to me. Well, what were you expecting? Considering the nature of artificial intelligence, Trying to find the reason why consciousness forms isn't going to help you decide whether you're human or not. I think Adam is right. Why don't you try something else? Maybe you could watch the citizens of Zion as they go about their lives. You haven't made much headway on your own. I suppose you're right. Thank you for your advice. I must prepare for my migration to try something new. And there you have it. That's that. So I'm sure we will. Ha he will appear. Wait, where am I going? I'm sure, he will appear in Zion next time we go there, which is right now. I really want to see what's over here though. Like if I can cross over here somehow. Did I do it really quick? Oh, it's just so far away. I'm gonna try it.
Another unlucky day. I can't handle any resources of value. Scavengers have scavengers prove themselves with the resources they salvage. I can't return to Zion empty-handed, or they might put me in the cradle. I swear I thought I'd been over here. There's this, and I, there's a human too. We were tricked. The city of Zion doesn't exist. Let's go back to the Matrix, okay? Fine, do what you want. Go back by myself. There's this campsite right here. There's this crate right here. Man, I missed out a lot over here. There's no need to be sad. Time for me to see my husband again. I don't have any more regrets. Let me go now. Man, I missed out on a lot of things. I saw it. I definitely saw it. An angel. An angel was fighting. There was a group of Natibas surrounding her. It was amazing. In a second, she dealt with all of them. Mother Sphere sent, us, sent an angel for us. Mother Sphere would never abandon us. Oh, here's the angel. Fallen angel. This isn't even the pl oh my god. I haven't been here either, but this isn't even the place that I was thinking about going towards. Oh yeah, I remember that. That's the part that I want to drop down into. I see. I see how to drop down. Okay. Mind them. And I do not know how to get down there.
Oh wait, there's a bridge. So there has to be a way to get up there. That's how you do it. Let me see if I can find a way up here. This way? Yep, I think I found it. That's crazy. Wait. I didn't find it. I'm close. It seems like I'm close, but this is definitely not the way up. Oh, wait. Or is it? Oh, it is. Oh, jeez. Oh, these are the... The things that you find... In the that one area where you only shoot your guns. I'm surprised that there's nothing, like, here. But, I mean, I guess it all connects down this way. Oh, there is something over there. so crazy. There's like a whole area that just went unexplored when I first came here. These technical things might be the most annoying thing in the game. Enemies in the game. The fact that they spawn, like, most of the time somewhere that, like, there's treasure or something, so you don't necessarily expect them. Truth Article 1, the wiretapping devices around us. Shocking news, an electronic device, an electronic devices, robots, and drones listening in, in on your private lives? Eidos, Orca, Tesla Star, three mega company cartels monopolizing personal information and big data. The advent of a dystopia in which companies dominate politics, society, and the economy. Unless we go back to the Stone Age, it is nearly impossible to avoid these giant companies. A feature as seen by a leading security expert. 12 habits to protect your personal information. Learn to defend your freedom. An exclusive report from our reporter, Quinn. Only in the truth.
man, we made it. There's only one enemy here. Go ahead and open up this door right away though. I'm not scared. I'm not sad. I don't have any regrets. I'm calm. Grateful that my final moments are so peaceful. Oh, 23, 3. I see now. Does this one contribute at all? Like, do I put them all on here? Oh, I guess so. I didn't- I thought like, just one per thing. Like, I didn't think it could read that three of them were on it. There we go. Got a can! Officially done now. Come back to the tetrapod at any time. Let's go back to Zion. Complete all these missions that we have. Welcome, sister. May Mother Sphere bless you. Do you have good news? I wish I did. Here. Felix's memory stick. No. What happened? It seems Felix was wandering through the Great Desert. Convinced he'd heard the voice of truth. He claimed that Mother Sphere was no god. And that he heard, saw, and felt the truth. I'm not sure if he had lost his mind, or if he was after something. It's a miracle I found his body. It cannot be. 
It might have been better if none of this had been revealed. He was mad. The words of a madman cannot be considered blasphemy. But why did Mother Sphere let Felix suffer such torment? And if Felix was indeed mad, then why would I come up in his last moment? Oh, Mother, Master of all knowledge, why have you tasked me with such trials? Please, forgive Felix. Please, forgive me as I pray. Let there be light again. Let there be light again. All right, move on. On to the next one. What's an angel doing here? How are you involved? I know those people never made it back from the Great Desert. I see, so that's what happened. The truth can never be concealed. Have you not noticed something's wrong with Oracle? People settle for order and feign ignorance. What do you mean? Are you sure everything you believe is true, Angel? That is all I can say. But remember, next time, you might end up in our shoes. I just heard the songs of the siren. I knew you could do it, Angel. Did you find the treasure? When the siren first started singing, everything started lighting up. But there wasn't much after that. Is that really it? I suppose I thought a resting place would be more special. I'm sorry about all this. My misunderstanding just wasted your time. No, it's like Adam said. Having somewhere to lay your head can give you the strength to stand on your feet. Sometimes a place to rest is its own kind of treasure. Yeah, it's like how Zion is our resting place. I'll be going now. Let me know if you learn anything else important. Yeah, of course. Be safe. Still can't get in here, right? Report to this girl. I think her sister's dead Welcome or something like that. Angel. Seems like we're seeing a Welcome. Yep. You're here, Angel. What about my sister? Kaya. Well there isn't an easy way to say this, so take this. Oh this this is a memory stick. That means Yes. I took out an Atiba called Behemoth. <laughs> that looks funny. Retrieved it from the area. It looks so He's unserious with that outfit. Avenged. And like such a serious moment like this. Is that what it is? Actually, I figured this would happen. I knew my sister couldn't have survived like that. I was just hoping for the best. But I guess all I was doing was just denying reality. Kaya. It's okay. The important thing is that I have my sister's memories back. Her memory will live on in me, running our establishment together. Thank you, Angel. Please come back again soon. Oh. Cool. What? My goodness. So there really was an energy source. G give it to me, Angel. Now, we had an agreement. You're supposed to give it to me. Damn, chill, buddy. An angel shouldn't lie. Give it to me. You hear me? 
hear yourself? How can you be so entitled? Eve, there's a fusion drive at the back of the store. Strange, isn't it? Wait, wait, you, you can't just... Come on, let's find out what's really going on. What's this? Ugh, well, you see, she's my wife. She died a long time ago. Your wife? Then you should have said so. How could I? I wasn't about to take any chances. Not that it mattered in the end. Well, that's all there is to it, Angel. I may talk big, but I'm still only human. Well. Guess he's not such a bad guy after all, huh? You can have the fusion cell. Oh. Okay. Thank you, Angel. All right. Keep going here. What's this right here? Not right here? Oh, it's right here. Oh yeah, this girl. I retrieved the memory sticks from the ruins. But there were far more dead people than there were intact memory sticks. D treasure. Treasure. My treasure. I won't lose it. <laughs> I'm sorry I couldn't protect you. I'm sorry I ran away. I'm sorry I survived. Eve, are you positive we can trust her with the memory sticks? I could hold on to them, make sure they reach Mother Sphere, but I think she'll be all right, Adam. All right. If you insist. You must recognize them. I don't think anyone blamed you. They just accepted their fate. Yeah, I see. Then I'll have to do my part as a survivor. I won't be able to achieve anything grand, but thank you, Angel. You took a load off my mind. The alcohol that you requested. Chateau du Lac, Jacques Tournel, Napa Ronti. Oh, the perfect combination. Thank you. Thank you so much, Angel. Thank you, Angel. I owe you my life. You must attend the memorial service when the full moon rises. Okay. Send me an invitation. I need to go now. Mm. It's been ages since I've tasted a wine of quality. Just, just a little taste. <laughs> Drink it all again? Okay. Now let's go to the bulletin board. Or actually, yeah. There's actually a mission right there that I forgot about. Did you get it? I knew I was right about you. The body call first. Well, look at you, miss. It's for the people of Zion. No need to stare daggers at me. Here you go. Where did you get this from? What did you do? Don't tell me you went after another airborne squad member. <laughs> no way. I wouldn't dare try to kill an angel. That's all you're getting out of me. Another important bit of info. There's always a secret to trade. Until next time, then. Remember, I'm always open for business. Got a body core. That's pretty good. 
This was the anyway. This wine must be a very compelling liquid. I went to Barry's storage room and saw three bottles of wine on display there. He said they they were for the memorial service. Clearly, they weren't a couple of days. They weren't there a couple days ago, and he won't tell me where he got them. What a greedy little, little jerk. I have to go to the cradle soon. Before that, I want to take a nice long sip of that smooth and sour elixir. Only scavengers see this request note. If any scavengers see this request note, bring me a bottle of Chatu Maluk. Malak, you won't be disappointed with the rewards. Thanks. Precious treasure, by the time you read this, I will already be asleep in the cradle. Called the cradle, but isn't it more like a tomb? I'm writing this because before I left for the cradle, I hid one of the most precious treasures in a box. Whoever finds it will become the owner of that treasure, but wouldn't it be boring to just tell you where it is? Find the abandoned yellow bus on the collapsed overpass in the Great Desert. Move the box there. Good luck on your journey. This request sounds fun. If she's updated her store. I didn't come in. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I had a good time. Let's leave it. We do got a new mission there, though. Oh. Yeah. Seeing you stand and walk. Yeah, she's got her legs now. I just. It's good to see. So. Just what is it that brings you two here? I have a request for you. At one point, a small drone came to the bar. A drone? Oh, do you mean Digger? The drone heard Enya singing, said it recognized the song, then just left. I've done everything I can, but I can't seem to find that drone. Eve, I'm sorry to bother you with this. If it has something to do with my lost memories, do you think you can get more details from the drone? Well, Digger should be in Zion. It shouldn't be too difficult to find out. Oh, thank goodness. I'll let you know the second I hear anything. In the meantime, you should head back. Best to stay safe. Thank you. Thank you, always. Alright, so of course we pick up more missions. I'm not gonna do any of them right now. We'll save that for next time. We've cleared out a good majority of them though. Alpha mating. If it hadn't been for Oracle before heading to the orbit elevator. Sailor. Alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead and cap it off there. We did a lot of side missions, a lot of exploring in the Great Desert, even further exploring in the wasteland of an area that I realized I didn't really cover. So, definitely, definitely did a lot. So next time what I'm gonna plan on doing is we have just a couple of side missions left or uh, I want to move on. There's like two or three that I want to do and they seem super easy. So I'm going to knock those out and then we'll head to the next area of the game in terms of the main mission. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe and peace.